The day before Valentine's Day is one of the most important days of the year for local florists and specialty gift shops. But the snow like we had today means that fewer people can get out and pick up those items they need. News Center Sean Snack Stackhouse joins us now. And Sean, what are these local businesses doing to try and get ready for the big day tomorrow? Hey, Cindy. Well, yeah, all of these local businesses in Bangor were ready for a lot of customers to be coming in to either pick up those flower orders or those last minute chocolates. But today's snow really threw a wrench in that plan. So I spoke with three local business store owners about what they're doing to get ready for the big day, Valentine's Day tomorrow. I was hopeful that the weathermen were wrong. <laughs> I was hoping to wake up and have it be totally clear. However, it was anything but clear this morning when Eliza Butler woke up. She's the owner of Specialty Suites in Bangor, and she was hoping for a busy pre-Valentine's Day rush. This is a huge part of our operating revenue for the rest of the year. So it's, I don't know, we're hoping people will still come out. Slower business today means an even more hectic tomorrow for businesses selling the Valentine's Day essentials. It has put more of a burden on tomorrow because a lot of the businesses were closed today or the schools were closed. With tomorrow's now expected busy day, it means employees had to actually make it to work today, even in the snow. I didn't have any complaints. Uh, they all came in. Uh, we double our staff uh, this week and towards the end of last week getting ready for it. And these stores will be ready for the day that makes their entire year worthwhile. It's going to be one, one busy day. Uh, We'll have people lined up coming in, uh, picking up flowers. We are hoping that people will still come out tomorrow and do like last minute shopping who maybe didn't get out today. All right, so as you can, uh, can see behind me with all of Broadway Park, it is just coated in snow. We really got a lot today and I've been out since around three in the morning and it's really not easy conditions. Finally, a lot of cars are out on the roads, but some parts still aren't completely clear throughout Bangor. A lot of those main roads are looking pretty good, but let's hope that they're a bit better tomorrow in case you need to go out and either grab some of those last minute chocolates or pick up your flowers. But if you do go, first you gotta worry about the roads, but then you have to worry about long lines at the florist or at that candy store. So be cautious tomorrow. That's all, all right. I have in Bangor. Cindy, back to you. All right, Sean, thank you so much.